Hey, what's up guys? Matt here with Acoustic Selection. I'm going to teach you a song that I wrote recently called It Makes Me Want to Sing. It's going to use the track method. Let me play through it here so you get familiar with it and then I'll teach it. Okay, now let's go over how we play that. It uh, uses that track method. I got the capo, it's an F sharp key because I start out in the key of E and then I raise it, you know, each each uh, fret you go raise it half a key. So first fret would be an F and then the second fret F sharp. So that's how you do the keys there. Uh, we'll start out at E, then A, then B, then A. Now I taught the track method how that way if you want you can do E down here and stay on that track because it uses those four chords it uses an E, C sharp minor, a B and an A. What I did there is I play the regular standard E then A, B and C sharp minor. So it's the same as the track just instead of that high E I was doing a regular E. Uh, remember go to the playlist tab on the bottom I have PDF files I have the lyrics and the chords so you can have something to refer to there but uh, it's going to start out tell me what kind of king would leave his throne I'm doing a palm mute that just quiet quietens the strings and I'm chopping down two beats per chord tell me what kind of king would leave his throne that's E A B A to save a rich like me. Then I go E B A. He's amazing grace. How sweet. That's where I go up that track. E to B. Then up two frets. C sharp minor. A. He's amazing grace. How sweet the sound. It makes me wanna. 
then finish out the E, B, A again. Make sure you print out or look at the PDF file. Where you're not familiar with this song, you won't um, you won't know how to play it there. And then the chorus is going to be the exact same order. It's going to go E, B, A, E, B, A, E, B, C sharp minor, A. Yeah, it makes me wanna sing. It makes me wanna sing. When I think of all you've done for me, it makes me wanna sing. Then instead of the A, the last one I go B back to E. Now, that's if you want to get more advanced, start out just down strum. Down, down, chop, chop. Yeah, it makes me wanna sing. It makes me wanna sing. When I think of all you've done for me, it makes me wanna sing. Fun strumming pattern, definitely more advanced. It takes a while to get that. So down, 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 up, down, up with a palm mute. share and don't forget on uh, if you go to shop on acousticselection.com under shop right now you can download this mp3 just an acoustic version just like I just played an mp3 for free if you want to share it with your friends or maybe see if someone likes it there uh, jump into a quick devotional here so for this devotional really quickly the, the song comes from Colossians 3:16. now a lot of people know John 3:16. for God so loved the world he gave his only son whosoever shall believe in him shall not perish but have everlasting life but Colossians 3.16 is an awesome one also. That's where the song comes from. It says, Let the word of Christ dwell in you richly in all wisdom, teaching and admonishing one another in psalms and hymns and spiritual songs, singing with grace in your hearts to the Lord. And it goes on 17, whatever you do, do everything for the glory of God. Giving thanks to the glory of God. But that 316, I love it, singing with grace in your hearts to the Lord. Let, it says, let the word of Christ dwell in you richly. The song says, it makes me want to sing. And that's what I was thinking about when I wrote this. Just think, just we, we take it too casual as Christians. Okay, Jesus came, he, he left the throne of heaven, born a virgin birth, lived a perfect life as an example for us, uh, gave us a mission and a purpose, ultimately died for our sins, took our place in the cross. And we... Particularly if you grew up like I did and you're in church every Sunday, you just take it so casually. And I, I say, sometimes I just want to stop and say, God, let me, let me just stop. Slow down my life and ponder upon that. You, that. you left the throne of heaven to come down here, the perfect spotless lamb, and die a sinner's death on that cross in my place. You're perfect, righteous, and holy. I'm this, my greatest righteousness is as filthy rags. And you come down on that cross and take up on the sin of the world on my behalf. It makes me want to sing. That's what I keep saying. It makes me want to sing. When I think about what you've done for me, it makes me want to sing. Are you singing with your life today? That's my challenge to you and challenge to me. Does your life sing the praises of Jesus? What does he have to do? The Bible says you were bought with a price. Think of the price he paid for you. He left the throne of heaven. He didn't have to do He created this whole world. But he made you and I a way, a path. That last verse says, you go to, you, you've prepared a place for me in heaven from John 14 or 15, I think it is. That I go to my father's house, my father's house for many mansions. I go to prepare a place for you where I am. You may be also. It, just let that sink in, guys. Christ paid the greatest price for us, and let's sing and give him the glory today. Love you guys. Subscribe if you haven't. 
message me with any questions and God bless you.